10 Cations, your source for cool vacation stay reviews. Tedcations. Welcome back to another Tedcations episode for season one. And this time in my home state of Texas, I had to get away for a bit. So Austin became my go-to destination. My home away from home this time was the JW Marriott. Let's check out my room. It's the JW, AKA John Willard Marriott, the founder of the Marriott Corporation. And a JW Marriott is a higher level experience than just a Marriott. Life is about experiences, so I had to go for it. I stayed in an executive suite. Thank you, points. You walk into a very open and bright living room space, really great views. My favorite was the view of Lady Bird Lake. Design-wise, the room is very nice, cool artwork, some eclectic furniture with modern taste. The bedroom kept the modern taste going with some nice accents like on this headboard. The mattress, eh, gotta admit that for me it was a tad too hard, but you may love it. Pillows, yeah, yeah, ooh, nice. The bed's other highlights were the cool book light, and of course each side of the bed had working lamps. And these were really cool because they have water in these lamps. The TV for the bedroom was the same as the living room. And the sliding door separating the bedroom from the living room was another nice touch. On to the bathroom. A third sliding door. Two showers. One a standard tub and shower and the other a very nice walk-in shower with easy access. Towel racks. Very roomy toilet area. You know I like that and you get the common shampoo, conditioner, and lotion supplies. Can be ashy. Cool shell looking lights too. Look at JW, just taking care of it. There was plenty of closet space complete with iron and ironing boards, safe and bins for whatever you need. The last area had the standard coffee, tea, and refrigerator. It didn't seem like a good spot at first, but having it away from everything and not in your exact comfort space was pretty good. The standard office desk was behind the living room couch along with some great lighting in the window behind you and at night two very good lamps. Outside the room is top notch hallway decorations, the lobby, chill areas before the elevators, digital kiosks to keep you informed, all makes for great attention to detail. Oh, and the spa, gym and pool. You gotta fuel up for all that. So with your exclusive executive access, hit the executive lounge for some delish breakfast. Now let's hit the spa, the pool, and the gym. Hey, though, snaring hard kick. This is it. The coke came in the crack. We all found the same. The gym is great, but I gotta give it an A minus. They just don't have enough heavy weights for me. My body's way too powerful. Whoa. That's the reason why I came to you. JW Marriott, Austin, Texas, at the pool. Man, time to talk about what to do in Austin. Here are a few of my suggestions. Go to a winery. Yes, you are near Texas wine country. My go-to for you, Driftwood Winery. Then when you get hungry, make it a point to take an Uber or your rental down to Salt Lake. Get you some good old barbecue. It's good, trust me. And you know you have to walk all that food and wine off, so I suggest next you take a hike to Covert Park at Mount Bono. It's a very short climb to a gorgeous view of Lake Austin. From there, you take any number of trails that you like back down to your car. Just be careful. They can be very rocky and a bit slippery. And the last excursion activity I recommend while in Austin, staying at JW's, is to rent a kayak, paddle boat, or a canoe and just lounge on Lady Bird Lake. Very relaxing. Okay, peeps, your boy's done with another Tedcations. 
make some time to get you some Austin in and do it in style with my guy JW. That's JW Marriott. Remember, we are still in this COVID pandemic, so be safe. I'm out. Tedcations, your source for cool vacation stay reviews. Tedcations, 